Hello, children. My name's Ilya2, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Victoria 2, the HBM mod with Scandinavia. In the last episode, we actually declared war on the North German Federation. Yeah. Yeah, you heard that right. We declared war on them. Now, why would we declare war on them? Well, originally, it was... To let Hanover free. Now, why would I want that? Well, because the uh, North German Federation was at war with France. And I thought, hey, this is a good opportunity, if any, to beat the living crap out of them before they beat the living crap out of me. Because they have cores on me. But then I realized I could dismantle their entire nation. Their entire empire. Every single little core of another nation, including Hanover would be free. And not only that, but I would get, uh, how many? 1,226 prestige from this. We're at 60%. We are besieging Berlin with over 100,000 troops sitting there. This could possibly be the most important war I have ever fought in a Victoria 2 campaign. Germany has constantly been a problem every single game, but in this game, we're fixing that problem. Let us continue. All right. So now, uh, we want to make sure we beat the living crap out of them even more. How many soldiers they got? Still 467, but most of those, I'm assuming, are going to be damaged. Hopefully, France can hold them off still. I want them to be as distracted as possible. Uh, their war is going badly. The battles are very high, but the defender occupation is good on their side. So let's get this dude and move him out. All right, what else we got? Uh, another 35,000. Move there. Now we're losing a lot of money, but we can deal with it. As long as we slaughter as many of them as possible, we will not take a white piece. Thank you very much. All right, you guys go there. A lot's being lost in this war, but a lot's going to be gained. A lot is going to be gained. We need to win this. We just simply have to win. Uh, go up there now. All right, all right. We'll survive. We'll, we'll make it. We need Berlin. Once we take Berlin... I think it'll all be over. I think it'll all be over. They have a lot of really good defenses. It's annoying. We have all of our soldiers down here. All of our uh, mobilized troops down here. Wait, what is this like? Oh, no. This is just bad luck. We need more troops. All right. All right. All right. Come on. We can do this. All right. Another battle is over. Did they run away or did they all die? I think they all died. Hey, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, you move over. Slaughtering them up there. No, we're not we're not surrendering. We're not doing a white piece. We'd lose a lot of prestige if we did white piece. We're not gonna do that. We're not accepting it. Okay, I'm going to be silent through a lot of this simply because I'm thinking. Thinking a lot. Where the occupation's at? It's almost 13. Jesus Christ. Uh, I need to win this. Need to win this. Go up there, help them out. Alright, you're done. Move on there. Oh, you crushed them. What do you got now, son? 396? Alright, alright, alright. Oh, man. Oh, man. This, this whole war is just bloodshed everywhere. Berlin has fallen. Fallen. 
Yes, yes, yes! Force the North German Federation to dismantle their empire, reducing their, uh, not only prestige, but industry, military, everything. Proceed. What? 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 <laughs> sorry, sorry, I'm sorry. Um See, I'm See, last time I checked, dismantling an empire usually usually involved I don't know. Them dismantling. Why do they still have Lithuania? Why do they still have Hanover? Why do they still have all this land? Am I missing something here? Was I wrong? Is that not how dismantling an empire works? Or... Or what? I have to have missed something. Right? I had to have. Right? I'm getting war reparations, which is good. Hopefully this helps to collapse the North German Federation. They're, wow, they're at 50%. We're at 0% war exhaustion. Yeah, but, um... The fuck? I dismantled their empire. What's going on here? What, what what's going on? <laughs> serious seriously, what's going on? Why aren't you dismantling? Is it because they're at war right now? Maybe it's because they're at war. I don't know. Okay, whatever. We'll we'll move on from that. Okay. <laughs> Uh, wow. Did not expect that to not happen at all. Hello? What? Why didn't they collapse? I mean, Russia did... Russia collapsed? Do, do they not collapse? Home rule for Iceland. What? Icelandic all thing is voted to request that they granted home rule, saying the time has come for greater independence under the plan in Scandinavia would continue to manage the nation's foreign affairs and defense interests. Uh, we can release Iceland. Or not. Why would we release you, Iceland? No, you're part of the Scandinavian Union, son. Alright, hopefully this war continues in France's favor, because I want Germany to pay... I want them to pay. But at least we got a crap ton of prestige. Now we're at number two, three. Almost number two. The amount of prestige we have is amazing. Look at that. That's huge. It's absolutely huge. That's great. Wow. Do we seriously not have enough intellectuals still? Oh, you know, it's probably people down here. Probably Africans. That's why. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, whatever. Uh, maybe it's because they're at war. I think it's because they're at war. Because if the Russians can collapse, why don't the North Germans collapse? At the very least, lose Lithuania, you know? Huh. I don't know what's going on. I really don't know what's going on. Oh, they're losing it. They're at 36 now. Oh, what? The North Germans only have 38? Dude, they lost everything. They're going to lose everything. The The French are going to win. I mean, sure, it's a status quo, but the French are going to win. Nice. We really changed, changed the fate down here. Jesus Christ. Germany has fallen from grace to down the seventh place. Seventh place. And we helped. 
Oh. Russia wants help? No. Uh, no. None of, none of you. Uh, yeah, sir, position, why not? Crisis averted. Trouble is brewing in Italy. Oh. Uh, get that, get that, and get that. I shouldn't have done that, because we're really close to the, um... Uh, infamy limit. Very close, actually. <laughs> Better be careful. Our Keynesian economics is about to finish. There we go. Let, ooh, limited access roads. Or synthetic? No, limited access roads. Finally, finally, Germany falls apart. Ooh, this feels good. This feels really good. Oh, they lost Annex Baden. They annexed Württemberg? Oh, no. Poor Württemberg. Terrorist cells. Wow, they have 80 there? I thought they ran out. Oh, they still have 41. That's their entire army right there. The entire army. Heck, even Peru's getting in on this. Good job, Peru. Alright. Uh, Circassia. What the heck is Circassia? Oh, down here? Oh, they're at war with Nor the North Germans. Wait, are the North Germans... No, wait. Why are they at war with North Germany? Circassia. Ukraine. Oh, they're in with this, aren't they? Yeah. So it seems that Ukraine is conquering from Russia. Well, hey, good on ya. Good on ya. How many you got? You got 70. Ukraine probably do not have 70. You have 64. Wow. What's the tech at? 16 and Russia... 18. Ooh. That's gonna be... Problematic. Good luck. I wish you the best. North Germany... Wow. If they aren't going to fall apart, I'm going to be surprised. They, they better have a ton of rebellions. They better have a ton of rebellions. They're going to have rebellions. Come on. Or even better, if they, when this peace deal starts, they, they collapse. Because we're supposed to see them collapse, right? Or not. Never mind. Oh, there it is! <gasps> yes, he had to... Peace out! Oh my god, look at them! The Treaty of Berlin, we have lost the war and like vultures, the victors have descended upon us. We have been forced to the bargaining table to accept humiliating terms regarding the breakup of our empire, with many of our lands simply given away, and we shall be permitted no overseas holdings whatsoever. This is in the, this is a moment that shall be remembered in North German Federation in the North German Federation for years to come. All right, so North German colonies. One of the matters discussed in the treaty talks about what we should do with the North German Federation's colonial holdings. They should not be allowed to keep these lands, but determining how they should be disposed of is no simple matter. For now, agreement has been reached determining some of the territory, and any remaining will have to be negotiated over in the coming year. We will take what we can. Oh, uh, crap, we have too high. Only limit North German power, or we have no interest in their colonies. Okay. I'm not cheating here. It's kind of BS because I accidentally took that extra two prestige there. You saw it. That doesn't, that not prestige, uh, extra two infamy. You saw it. I didn't mean to do that. Let's do this because I didn't even understand how this would work. So, okay. We'll take what we can. There you go. I don't even know what they had, but we'll take what we can. How's it feel, North Germany? Let's see who popped out of them. So we have Saxony, Silesia, Poland ate it all, and Danzig. Oh, Danzig. Hey, they look like actual uh, Germany now. We have Congress, Poland there, and Lithuania popped out as well. How's it going, guys? I hope it's going good. All right, Silesia. Let's be buds. Saxony. Let's be buds. Oh, Saxony's eighth? Holy crap. Prestige on Saxony is massive. Well, you know. Good for you. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. This is fantastic. This is really, really fantastic. Oh no, Luxembourg. Don't get influenced. 
<laughs> Screw you, North Germany. Screw you. <laughs> we win. Too bad no one can take Ostfutten. Looks more like actual Germany now. Austria-Hungary is getting influenced by Italy. Really? Well, Italy, get banned. You know, let's just stop influencing these guys. France wants to take it. France can take it. Persia? Wait, Persia's in our sphere? When was Persia in our sphere? Didn't even notice that. They have a lot of troops. Um, yeah, sure, Persia, you can be in our sphere, or whatever. Did I totally forget that Persia was, was in our sphere? I must have. Huh. I must have. How do they not hate North Germany right now? They're cordial with North Germany. That makes no sense. They sh oh, it, th that one's hostile. So Silesia is hostile. Danzig's also hostile. How has Danzig not joined Poland? Oh, it's part of Pomerania. Uh, okay. Okay. All right, more railroads, synthetic polymers, social alienation. Uh, let's get more of these projects going. Increase the size of all them. And now... Oh, yeah. Get rid of uh, the, the old tariff. Down 50%. There we go. Oh, we're still making a crap ton of money off the war. Should probably be careful. Anything else? Still trying to make that armor. Alright, time to be banned. Sorry, North Germany, you suck. Canada? Canada's a great power! They're no longer a sphere or satellite of the UK. Oh my! Good job, Canada! Yeah, go Canada. Eh? <laughs> Alright. That's cool. So, so you have Australia down here, New Zealand down there. Cool, cool, real cool. All right. Now, who, okay, who can we ally with? We still, we're still allied with France. We're allied. Ooh, we should ally with. They are. We are allied with Danzig. Uh, Silesia. Should ally with you. And Saxony. Oh, Saxony's in their sphere. Never mind then. Whatever. No matter. Alright, we gotta ban the French. Sorry, Francie Pants, but you can't be in my land. Cool. Cool. Fascists assert power. Holy crap. 20% fascism? No. Screw fascists. I don't want fascism to pop up, man. No, 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 no. That ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna happen. You guys can stay at 10% all you want, but it's not gonna get any higher than that. Oh, let's go bankruptcy. Instead of a debtor's prison. Yay. In the dunk tank. Uh, rich strata. We have very little of that. So they can be pissed off all they want. All right, cool. Everything's cool. North Germany fell, has fallen apart. Persia, of course we can ally. You guys, I'm assuming you guys can't build any brigades. I'm surprised you guys aren't falling apart right now. How aren't you? What's your militancy like? It should be massive. It should be massive. Jeez, the UK is so many people. It's scary. Canada, you're a great power. You're still a great power. You're 10th in the world, but still a great power. All right. Um, yeah, I guess Sinai can get more assimilation. That's fine. You're still 100% misery. Misery. And yeah, it's a lot of Turkish. Uh, cool. Cool. Uh, yeah, that's happening. Put this down. 
what do the spheres look like right now? Uh, yeah, Poland is in the UK. They're in... I'm sorry, they're not going to join that. No, they should. They probably will. Well, as long as North Germany stays down, I'd be happy. How do they have... They have zero soldiers, and yet they still have... Points. Alright, yeah, we want that mutual funds. Organic work. Yeah, support the movement. Arab uprising in Luxor. Oh, looks like Silesia joined Poland. Uh, put it down quickly. Well, bye Poland. Well, bye Silesia. Danzig, I'm assuming you're going to do the same. Even though you're a republic. Maybe they're going to be like a very tiny one city republic. That'll be that'll be cute. <laughs> Mayday parade. Uh, yeah, sure. Gain militancy, whatever. Oh, RGO throughput increase. Oh, whoa, whoa, Luxembourg, ban them, ban the French. All right, everyone's going up again. Still a lot of fascists. I don't like that. Establish a protectorate on Macron. What the heck is Macron? I don't even know. Oh. Oh, Russia's falling apart again. North Germany, you're not falling apart. Why aren't you? Come on, man. Look what you, look at what happened to your country. This all this all because your your um empire's stupid. That's why. You guys can't even form Germany. You're that lame. How's it feel? How does it feel? Alright, put this down quickly. And, oh, God, there's so many. There are four liberal parties, two conservative parties. That's ridiculous. Alright, interventionalism. Of course, I still choose who's the ultimate ruling party anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Wow, we can build a lot more people. Uh, so screw all this armor, because we're not building it. Let's build five. One, two, one, two, three. Heck, let's just go all the way. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, one, two, three. There you go. 20 more brigades. Yeah, pro-militancy. Mil military, pro-military. Oh, uh, I guess the fascists aren't accepting defeats. Never mind, they are accepting defeats. Back to a presidential dictatorship. <laughs> can we declare war on you again? Yeah, we can. They only have 69 soldiers with 18 tech. We're at 26. Huh. We may want to attack them again. Of course, our infamy is very high. Nah. Can we shoot now? No, we'll, we'll just deal with them later. Alright, no, not pacifism. Pro-militancy. There you go. Militancy? Why do I keep saying militancy? Pro-military. There we go. Are we getting more? Yeah, this peace deal is still going on. How long does our truce last? Truce to Scandinavia for another six years. Six years. All right, who are we at war with? Italy? No, Poland. Polish liberation. I mean, you have a lot of people on your side. The UK, uh, I really don't want to go to war with the UK. Let's get modern divisional structure. Although, to be fair, Poland, I'd say we could take them. What do they got? 90, you got 59. God damn. And I won't even be able to get through there because obviously North Germany is not going to allow me through. Um, maybe the UBP? No, they're not letting me through. And I, I won't have naval dominance. You know that. Screw it. We're not going to say yes. I hope it goes well. You guys have more troops than Poland alone. And maybe the UK won't send a lot of troops over there. 
But yeah. Poland, what are your cores? Oh god damn it. One second. You have one core on that one land on Silesia. <laughs> You're just that's the that's what the war is over. Alright. So we wanna get that one. And I know I won't forget it, don't worry. Subsidize. Open and subsidize, just in case. Alright, no, this is supposed to be fifty percent. Right, right, right. All right, and the Netherlands, yeah, you guys can have access. I hope you guys win. I really do. Really hope it. Uh, I'm assuming you will. Although the British can go through Poland there. And oh my god. Jacobins in the Turkish Socialist Republic. Well, we might, might see Turkey. We might see Turkey pop up. Oh, Poland got destroyed. Really? That quickly? Oh my god. Well, Poland. Bye-bye, Poland. See, you guys didn't need me at all. However, the Turkish are going to fall apart if you don't get back there soon enough. So, I would suggest getting back there, Turkey. Just saying. Austria-Hungary is getting influenced by Russia. Oh, Russia is a uh, great power again. Good for them. And, of course, Luxembourg banned the French. Sorry, France. We're friends, but still. Wait, are we not an alliance? Did I say we weren't an alliance? No, we are. Okay, that's dissolve alliance, not form alliance. Uh, yeah, the Polish failed miserably. Get wrecked, Poland. My little buddy can destroy you. Heh, heh, heh. No, no one's doing anything. All right, Saxony, although Saxony, where's Saxony? All right, Saxony's under uh, Italy, so I don't care. Uh, no, suppress it. We want terrorist cells. That's fine. Ka oh, Kashigara. I was about to say, whoa, crap, Turkey, but no, Kashigara. What the heck is that? Ka Kash Kashgar. Uh, I don't know what that means. Whatever. Oh, United Arab Emirates. They're partially Western. Oh, they're a satellite of UK. All right, makes sense. UK has a lot of influence down there. They do indeed. Oh, they have both those lands too. That's annoying. Oh God, Italy. Ah, oh, it's Italy. Why Romania again? It is the Austro-Hungarian liberation of Central Hungary. Oh God, you did it again, didn't you? Why, why, why do you do this to yourself? Why? You know we're not gonna help. We never help you guys. Let's just increase relations. We're not even gonna ally, because maybe that's the problem. We're allying with them so much that they think we're gonna join up, but we're totally not. Yeah, but you know what? This is where I'm gonna have to end this episode. Wow! Wow, this episode was great. North Germany fell apart. Ugh, not as much as I would have hoped. Not as much as I would have thought. But they lost all the lands that wasn't really theirs. <laughs> I don't understand why they don't have cores here on Danzig, but they should. They should. I wish there was a way to make them lose course. Like, lose course on Slash Week Holstein. That would have been amazing. But you know what? This is where I'm going to have to end this episode. So, hopefully in the next episode, we can co see continuing success. But you know what? The next episode may actually be the last. Game ends in 12 years. So, I don't know. Depending on what happens, maybe we declare one Russia. They are a great power, but they're weak. They're super weak. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Alier too, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.